grew up around metal and machinery, but not necessarily metal sculpture. Um, and I've just always been into the creative end of things from very early on. And I had a small metal shop in my parents' basement and started welding early, but did not try and turn this into a business or a career, even consciously ever. It just slowly went in this direction. I love the material. I love working in metal. Um, I feel like, uh, especially with the blacksmithing we were doing earlier, people have been hammering on hot metal for, for an awfully long time, and there's something very um, real and, and physical about that. It's like I want to go into, into metal work and metal sculpture, but try and find the most creative projects we can get our hands on. The um, Northampton Planning Department approached us probably nine months ago about designing a new mural and they had to do their homework to make sure that, that the way that they were approaching this and that what they wanted to do was going to work and that was going to be accepted and was, was all okay. Ultimately didn't have this finalized with a signed contract until just a couple of months ago. Um, and, once, and once everything was finalized and was approved, uh, we ordered the materials and started to, uh, to work on it right away. We're hoping to put it up this fall. There's a lot of work that's left to be done. Um, most of it's figured out, but like we were talking about earlier, there's a lot of details that we still have to, not just details we have to figure out, but we still have to figure out how to actually fabricate what we've drawn in this plan in metal in 3D. And I love that challenge, and it's a lot of fun, but it's, it's a challenge nevertheless. And some of these pieces are really big, and they're really heavy. And just the logistics of moving this around, I mean, I have a big shop, but I mean, you, you look at this and the first thing you say is, well, how are you going to get this out of here? And so we have to build it, we're building it in sections in the shop. Some of those sections are going to get welded together out on the loading dock here. Then we're going to pre-weather it in the parking lot. And once all those pieces are fabricated in one piece, we're going to bring it in town and install it on the bridge. I mean, the basic concept is we're trying to capture the Northampton skyline and all the buildings and all the things that you see downtown. Um, and the way the perspective of this is set up is if you're right in the center of town, almost on the city hall side, looking east on Route 9, you see this row of buildings with commerce and restaurants and shops, which we tried to capture on the left-hand side. Going down, you see the first church, the courthouse. In the background is the Holyoke Range. We even have the Summit House included. Uh, and on the right side, we've got the train station, with which uh, the planning department is going to bring back to life at some point, and they're going to have new train service in Northampton. So that was one of the main criteria they needed to see in this piece. Um, and we kind of had a little creative freedom in how we captured the depot building and put this whole thing together. But the stuff we build here, we put up and we see every day. That also puts an additional stress or a level of commitment to make sure that the pieces that are here are really good and that every little detail is something I'm happy with because I'll always notice it.